It's like the second I hit record, Daphne's like, oh, sorry, you needed me? Do you want to be in the vlog? I've been loving filming these vlogs and I feel like it's a really fun way for you guys to stay connected with me and it's fun to just let you into my life a little bit more. I'm the kind of person that I feel the need to maximize every single moment of every single day for the most part. I'm always thinking in my head there's something that could be done. It's been a little bit of a harsh reality little life lesson that that is how you, um, I don't know if you guys ever heard of this thing called burnout, but that's how you um, get there. So not that I'm burnt out right now, but definitely I've been filling my schedule extra full as of recently and I need to like slow down a little bit. I've been having some difficulty with like work-life balance and everything. I work a full-time job and then I work on the internet. And so I feel like I'm just kind of working seven days a week all the time. So with all of that being said, today's vlog is not going to be a super productive, work, busy, aesthetic, getting my life together kind of vlog. Today's vlog is quite frankly going to be the opposite of that. It's going to be a chill, day off, relaxing me day. And I'm gonna take you guys along with me because I still love vlogs. The beauty of today is that I have no plans and I don't want to give myself any plans. I just wanna go with the flow today because I have a hard time going with the flow. For anybody that does their hair and their makeup, what do you guys do first? Do you do your hair first or your makeup first? I personally like to do my makeup first. I don't know why. I don't have like a technique. I just like to do it first. She's a little greasy this morning, a little extra frizz, but we're gonna make it work. This is really weird, but something I've been adding into my like hair routine, I guess, I don't know. I saw this on TikTok, I see everything on TikTok. I've been taking a fuzzy sock and let me show you. My issue is that whenever I sleep, I like toss and turn a whole bunch. And whenever I would wake up, like all my curls would be like what it is now. Like I didn't sleep with my sock last night. They just like flatten out, my curls flatten out or my hair gets like super duper frizzy as you can see. I saw this on TikTok, this girl's like, you take a sock, you, put your hair in the sock like this. And then for me, I just put like a little scrunchie around it like that. And you just go to sleep. It helps keep your curls kind of in a good place. The fuzzy sock actually seems to work really well. And it's crazy because it's a fuzzy sock. So you think it would make your hair frizzy, but it works. It's insane. I don't have a good routine as far as trying to refresh my curls. And right now I'm just barely brushing like the top of my hair just to try to get these little frizzy pieces in place. Right okay, now I just want to section off my hair and add some dry shampoo. I'm gonna need some dry shampoo today. Maybe I'll make a target run. I do need a couple of things and you know, I need a few things and then whatever else Target tells me I need when I walk through the doors because that's how it seems to work when I go there. I don't have a technique. All right, here's where I'm at. I just kind of tousled the dry shampoo through, did a little, light little brush. I've lost my curls, it's okay. I think I'm just gonna do like a half up, like little half down moment. Yeah, that's fine. I just kind of clipped it up. I don't know. It works. Hey Siri, what's the weather? It's currently cloudy and 79 degrees. Expect partly cloudy skies starting in the morning, then rain starting in the afternoon. Temperatures will be fairly consistent, okay. averaging about Okay, stop. Minutes. So it's definitely a warm day. It's not too hot though. It has been in like the high 80s here recently. So I'm gonna wear, I don't really know. Let's take a look in the closet. Okay, here is my outfit of the day. I love this so much. It's like so summery, it's so comfortable. We love it. This is just a basic tank top from American Eagle. It has a little spaghetti strap. It's adjustable in the back. It's a classic. These are my linen pants from Old Navy. They're the best. They're just black linen pants, but they're amazing. Obsessed. And of course, Converse, my shoe of choice. I feel like Converse are so timeless. They just withstand the test of time. So many years have gone by, different eras, different styles, and Converse are always in and they're the best. So yes, this is the outfit. This is the vibe for today. If you're wondering, yes, my ginger shots are still amazing. I love them so much. And I've been drinking one every single day. I did just reuse this plastic container from a ginger shot that I bought at Target like a while ago. So this is my homemade ginger shot inside. I'm just reusing the container. Ah, 
I may not be a green juice kind of gal, but I can get down with a ginger shot. I really like them. I love, I'm just, actually I'm obsessed with ginger. Let me show you. I didn't know that you can buy this from the store. So you know like the little ginger that you get on the side of your sushi? You can just buy that at the store. You don't have to order sushi just to have it. It's pickled ginger. It's just like the little ginger that comes on the side of your sushi. It's so good. I will literally eat this out of the container. It's delicious. The first stop that I need to make actually before I head to the farmer's market is just run to the bank really quick. I can't remember if this farmer's market is cash only, but I think a lot of the vendors do prefer cash. So I'm going to go pick up some cash first and then, then we're on the way to the farmer's market. One thing to say and it's that why am i not going to the farmer's market more frequently i just got so much stuff for ten dollars i literally went to the bank and withdrew fifty dollars and i was like 50 bucks should be fine i spent ten dollars i mean an absolute steal i made sure i gave them a tip though because i was like this is like super cheap um let's do a little farmer's market haul though i was finally able to use my actual farmer's market tote that I got from TJ Maxx from like forever ago, taking it to the farmer's market. So I got two zucchini and a yellow squash, I then got some pre-bagged arugula, just a little bit, which can I just say this is the perfect amount. Every time I go to the store, get a big bag of it, some of it goes to waste because I only want a little bit and this is the perfect amount. One vendor had organic ginger, so I got two more cloves of ginger because I'm gonna make some more ginger shots uh, maybe tomorrow or something, but got some of those. And then I got three lemons, this is two, but I got three lemons and then three limes. And then I got a couple of Roma tomatoes. And lastly, I got these two huge red bell peppers. The only thing I got for fruit, I just got a little thing of strawberries. Look how good they look. Oh, strawberries are seriously the best. I might have one in a minute. And then also a little thing of blueberries. So amazing. Look at this combo right here. Amazing. Let's try some blueberries. Mmm, so amazing. I could probably eat this whole thing right now, but I'm not going to. Um, they are the perfect amount of crunch with a little bit of sweetness, but a little bit of tartness. And the strawberries, again, look how amazing. I am going to try one right now. They're probably just as good. Mmm, so good. Anyways, what a fun little farmer's market haul. Next thing I want to do on my solo date kind of day is go grab some lunch. I don't know where I want to get lunch from, but I'm just going to drive around a little bit and see if I can find what I want. Although I have like three things in my head that I kind of am craving right now, and I'll probably end up going to Cava, which is like my favorite place to get a salad. Should I get a coffee? I had one this morning and I'm about to go just like run some fun errands. Should I get a coffee? No, I don't need a coffee. Can I get a cold brew coffee? Brew. Thank you. I you your star, right? Yeah. Right, you have a good one. Thanks, you too. Mm. Now that the iced coffee is secured, naturally it's time to go to Target because we're having a little knee day. And one of my favorite places is in fact Target. I'm a sucker for body scrubs and things for the shower. And oh wait, I think this is one of those dry brushes. I kind of want to try this. I saw it on TikTok. I actually am looking for new sunscreen this summer. And I don't know, I like Neutrogena, but I actually have heard about this Blue Lizard one. And I've looked it up, so I think this is the one that I'm going to get. Okay, I seriously love the Burst products. Like they have so many cool things in their line. This. this is like an instant resurfacing mask. I just have a lot of the cool stuff. I want to try so much of it, but honestly, I'm just here for the, the makeup remover. I told myself when I woke up this morning that I had one thing to get from Target and to not forget it. 
and I already forgot it. I will die on this hill, but e.l.f. brushes and e.l.f. products are superior. You just need like a new fluffy brush for blending. look at these fake plants i love these so much i love the wood on this one that would look so good in my room but then also this one has the white and it's long these are so cute i love them i feel like my mom's gonna kill me because they don't look real i don't know i kind of want one i really i don't know how i feel about that one i'm really liking this one though i feel like this one looks a little bit more real and i'm also a sucker for like the long leaves on a fake plant it. Yeah, I think I'm gonna get it. I remembered. It was dry shampoo. I do not recall the forecast involving rain. Hey Siri, what's the weather? Been rain starting in the afternoon. Okay. No umbrella, no prop. It's fine. Well, you know, it wouldn't be a Target run without a Target haul. First and foremost, my beloved, my favorite, the best. I am running low on a couple of mine. Also did not have any in my bag today. Um, so needed to add one to the collection. Okay, first bag. I only got two bags, so not that bad. I got some toothpaste. I, this was one of the necessities that I needed today. All right, this, because like 85% of my life is inspired by TikTok at this point, which by the way, can I just say, it's not just like a stupid, dumb dancing app for kids. I have learned so many useful things on TikTok. I've learned a little bit about dry brushing to help with exfoliating the skin. We'll report back on this. I don't know how it's gonna work on my skin, but it's worth a try. I got a loofah because I needed a new loofah. I've gotten one of these bowls before from Target from their little like college dorm section. They are the best for soups, for bowls of mac and cheese, for whatever your little heart desires. I have a gray one and this little gorgeous lilac one. I needed it in my life. So I got it. Of course, the like number two necessity was dry shampoo. Got another one. Batiste, chef's kiss, it's my favorite. I got this really cool um, iced coffee tumbler. As if I need more cups in my life, I don't, but I really like how thick and insulated this is. And it came with a little squishy straw there. I have a couple of clear tumblers that I've bought off Amazon before. I've dropped them several times, so they're starting to crack and the inside wall is leaking some. So it was time to get a new one and I just love the clear aesthetic to a coffee cup. I don't know what it is. I got, this is, okay, the other necessity. I needed some new makeup remover and this is the one I've been using for so, so long. This is the Versed Day Dissolving Cleansing Balm. This was a last second grab. I was walking toward the checkout and I saw this in the clothing section and I love it so much but it's just like a cropped button down I was looking for something like this and I found it and it's absolutely perfect it's a little wrinkly right now but this is exactly what I was looking for it feels like linen but I'm not sure but super super cute I really really like it lastly for this bag I wanted to find a new sunscreen this summer for my body by the way I use a completely different sunscreen for my face I've heard really incredible things about this blue lizard sunscreen it is mineral sunscreen which supposedly is the best option as far as UV protection and then um, I think environmentally wise especially if you're like going swimming in an ocean where there's coral reefs and stuff again I've heard really good things about it I'm thinking my skin will respond well to it I read a lot of reviews about people with sensitive skin that use it and like it okay bag two I did end up getting this plant I think it's so adorable um, mom if you're watching this let me know if this looks real or not my mom has the best self-taught green thumb I, like out of anybody i know that woman can keep everything and anything alive her green thumb is seriously i envy it um that's why i get fake plants because even though she gives me plants so graciously tells me how to keep them alive i do everything i can and they still die i don't know where i'm gonna put this in my room but it has the same color combo as my room the white the tan and a little bit of green I thought she was super cute and then the other thing i got i just needed new bed sheets i do like the target sheets these are just like the the room essential ones you know like the kind of go-to college brand i like the way these feel and i think this will be okay but i just wanted to get a new set only because the other ones are starting to peel a little bit and i can feel that when i'm sleeping on it and i hate it so just a new set of sheets and that's it for my target haul 
It's been a great day so far. I've had a great time just hanging out by myself. On to the next thing and I will see you guys in a little bit when I've decided on what I want to do. I just took like the best nap ever. I did not realize how much I just needed a midday nap until this moment. Um, what's my plan for the rest of the day? I have no plans. I think for now I'm just gonna hang out here. Embrace the snuggles. And then maybe I'll get up and make some dinner or something. Mm -hmm. 